Hello everyone, my name is Laylay. Today I'm gonna present you a project called Create and Manage Line. This is the main, main goal of our today's project. Regarding line, it is a number used to identify a logic unit and it should be uh, attached with SQC group protocol. SQC is the Internet's small computer system interface. It helps us to share one IP across different devices in line and WAN. The SQC initiator will start service to identify the long grip that access the LAN through the protocol. But we should specify the protocol through three methods. The first one is host operating system. The second is using uh, sign protocol. And the last one is uh, depends on different connections. So now let's start our today's project. We have to log into the VMware environment at first. After log into it, we have to go to the on command manager. It's over there. Let's just click it and open. We go to the lessons. Now we don't have the SQC lesson. So we click add and we use the save, shift lesson key, copy, paste, add. Okay. At that moment, we can see SQC lesson appear in the box. And if we go to the configuration protocol, SQC service is in the running status now. If it's not in the running state, we can also go to putty to run this three command. To run this three command, it, it will help to initiate the in SQC service in running state. And now we go to the server manager to, in, to do the setting up of initiator. First of all, we need to give it a service enabled. We install it from the server row. The subgroup is file and storage services. And under the file and the SQC services, we click all the installation file. We click next, next, and you finish. Then we have the SQC service available here. And then we just click on the property of initiator. First of all, we go to discovery because we need to figure out which linkage we need to enable. And as our storage is IP is 10.0.0.1, I just put it over there. And we go to advanced. We give the local adapter SQC initiator and also we configure initiator IP. Then we click OK. As long as I did it, we just go to see what happened. We got this one, and if we go to target, there's a new generated initiator name in the connected status. If you want to connect it when it's not in the connected status, click connect, add the connection to the list, enable multi pairs and go to advanced lo local adapter initiator IP. OK, click OK, and click OK. Oops, we need one more thing. We need to copy down the whole initiative name to use it to link the lines from storage. We just copy over there and save it. All right, let's go to another part. We go back to our command manager again. At the moment, we go to line, we should create a line. You can see, uh, first of all, we need to create a Initiator and initiator we should edit from this part. Just copy what you have from the previous steps. Click OK. This over there and click create. I have did it, so I just keep it here. And then we go to line management. Uh, I need to to demonstrate this project. So first one I have pre-created and then we did another. Click Create, Next, give a name of the new line, 
it's just line 2 for me. Line 4, S can see. Exercise. We leave the type as default and I put 100 on the thing. Take the thing provisions. Click next. And there are two options. One is to create a new flexible volume, another is, is using existing volume. I just want a new one, so I click next. Then to take the mapping, I can see protocol button and click next, next. After finish it, we have two new lines in our box. And they are both in online status. Now we can hide it over there in the volume. And now we should go to the disk management to check what happened with the new disk. Now it comes to disk. This one is in online status. And if I click here, New simple volume, create it, give a maximum of the volume size, click next, assign a full of a drive lighter, we just select the default five. And the format is quite good, we just leave it default. Alright, now we can see in this one we have a new volume. And it wants to formulate the disk, we just click yes. And we leave all everything default. Click start. The format is completed. Let's go to check what happened. Now we have a new volume called F. And if we open it, there's nothing, but we can put a, a file here. We call it test. All right. After configure it, if you want to do some move, 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 move action from line one to line two, for from one aggregate to another, you can this this common common line here to do the things. Okay. Thank you for watching. Have a good day.